What is going on guys, it's Triple G here with another Borderlands 3 video and today we're going to be going through Rocket Fear Moes. This is absolutely incredible, since the update Rocket Fear Moes has just excelled. We can stay in Iron Bear all of the time, however long we want. In addition to that, when we get out of Iron Bear, we have incredible, incredible damage. So she does best of both. It's absolutely incredible. If you would like to subscribe to the channel, please do so. It really does help support. Also, uh, we stream on Twitch five times a week, uh, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday, weekdays from about four o'clock UK time and weekends from about midday. And otherwise, let's get straight into the video. So the first thing that I would like to run through in terms of the video is that we are gonna be utilizing the Nets 2 magazines. So I have level 60 versions here, uh, but a level 57 version of a reflux. I will be including this save file uh, and these Hellshocks are max damage for level 60. So if you are interested in the save file, please hit up the Discord, links are in the description below. Uh, we're gonna be using a Raging Bear, which will basically just keep us in our Iron Bear for even longer. A Pearl for magazine size and damage. Grenades, you can use what you want. I'm using a Core Buster here, but uh, well, eventually we'll get a Cloning Man and Tracker. But uh, for now, that's what we're using. And I'm using a Transformer with Action Skill Start. But again, I'm probably going to replace that um, with uh, an ASE or something like that. In terms of the skills themselves, um, these are the trees. I'm not gonna go into them too much in detail. What I will say is that these are skills that are all built around Iron Bear damage. We're gonna be in our Iron Bear all of the time. So you're gonna want to have all the damage and we're gonna do a ton of damage. Um, I did touch into the blue tree as well because basically I'm, we're going to make sure that when we're out of Iron Bear, our next two mags never actually proc. We're gonna just stick in that one magazine and I will show you that shortly. Um, but essentially either we're in Iron Bear all of the time or if we're out of Iron Bear, we're doing a shed ton of damage. I did have five points spare, which I decided to put here in armored infantry, but you will have five points where if you want to distribute them a little bit differently than I did, please feel free to do so. So let's get on to the footage. So when you're approaching a bunch of enemies, you want to literally just jump into Iron Bear straight away. And then it is just a case of literally blowing everything up. It is so powerful, it's untrue with the with the class mod that we have on, uh, which is basically keeping us in Iron Bear. And the new skill damage that we've been put in uh, since the hot fix, we are just doing a shed ton of damage. And as you can see, as we're firing through, uh, we, we're not actually losing our skills. So we're going to have to stay in Iron Bear a ton of time. Now I'm going to jump out just to show you that what we're going to do here. So we're going to use this is the flipper. Um, I've basically got next two mags. And as you can see here, I'm not actually losing any ammunition. So I can hold the trigger. If you don't want to be in Iron Bear all the time, or sometimes the environment can get in the way, um, so you can't get through certain doors. But because the next two mags doesn't, it isn't time restricted. So it's not like AS, ASEs where we have a certain amount of time or action skill end where we have a certain amount of times. We've not reloaded this magazine. So we still have that 100% damage, which I have on this gun, which makes the build really powerful. And as you can see, as we're outside of the Iron Bear, we have a shed ton of damage. We don't, we're not, not really going to have any problems whatsoever with survivability because we're doing so much damage. And of course, uh, if we need to, <coughs> we can just jump back into Iron Bear and just like literally one or two shot enemies. It is in completely, absolutely insane right now. Mose has suddenly elevated to a ridiculously strong character and I cannot wait to take this into all of the content in the game. Guys, if you have enjoyed this video, like I said earlier, please consider subscribing to the YouTube channel. It really does help us grow. Otherwise, come and, see, come and speak to us on Twitch as well. And we have a really friendly group. And if you are after the save file, I will be putting this in the Discord once I've got the level 60 versions of the Reflux and the other weapons. But guys, I will catch you on the flip.